All right, welcome to Skinny TV on YouTube once again. So that was Matthew Enim Kujo. The boy is now becoming a big star in Squadland already. We look at it here on this channel. I've already brought you two updates on the boy. One, he said that he want to play for the Black Stars of Ghana. He's a young chap, Ghanaian, and he's doing very well for his new club, Dandy United, in Squadland. He is now the fans' favorite. We look at what he has come out to say concerning that here on this channel. Then Jordan Ayu has also come out to comment about Liverpool versus Crystal Palace where the match ended one all at Anfield yesterday. Officially brought you an update here on this channel. Then we will end all with Fatal Isahaku. He also played his first match for Sporting CP senior side in their league. That is um, the Portuguese Premier League. And he's come out with some comments. We we'll look at it here on this channel. Before then, smash on that subscribe button, put on the bell for more updates here on this channel. This video is also sponsored by Intercop. Intercop is a company based in Spain, do those with exports. So if you want to import anything to Ghana here or wherever you are watching me from, just contact them, pick the numbers on your screens, contact Intercop, and they are going to help you import quality but affordable goods. So let's begin with the fans' favorite. That is Matthew Enim Kujo. I brought you an update about two months ago that the player said he wants to play for the Black Stars of Ghana in the upcoming World Cup in Qatar. And now the boy has already been playing very well and he is becoming the fans' favorite. We saw you or we saw the video where the fans were actually singing his name out everywhere. It's Matthew Enim Kujo. They said they really love him and the boy is doing well. He used to play for Kumasi as He went or he moved on after one year to join Legon Cities in the Ghana Premier League. Then he later on moved to Dundee United. He's played in the junior side of Ghana and at 17 and at 20, he was part of the team that won or that conquered Africa last year. But he's now a player for Dundee United and he has been doing fantastically well. In their last home game, he came on and he won the man of the match for Dundee United when they lost by a goal to nil to Leverstein. Now, he played in their last game. That's the um, UEFA competition of which his club lost by his performance was very good and the fans were actually chanting his name talking about him he's come out to talk about what actually happened according to him he posted on his official twitter handle and um this was the information that he posted as you can read it on your screens he said thanks arabs the um tough past week but keep up with the love and support and we will fight to bring you better results starting from saturday some bad results on the road but we are still working hard to bring more smiles to your faces united in pursuit arab so according to him he said that from this saturday he is going to do well for the club to start putting smiles on the faces of the fans because they've showed him love and he is also going to do well for the club so let's move on to the next story the next story we have jordan Ayu, who also commented about how his team played against liverpool at Anfield, where they try to salvage a draw from this game. In fact, they took the lead through reference that had before Luis Diaz um, came with the equalizer for Liverpool. Of which Crystal Palace did very well, and Jordan he also did well. He was rated about 6.9. I brought you the updates here by some um, sites, and on so far score, he was rated 7.0. I told you how he performed yesterday. The video is here on this channel. Just go and check it out. And, um, what he came out or what he came out to say is um he said great performance last night thanks for the amazing away support as always hashtag crystal palace fc hashtag ghana so he has actually tapped ghana telling us yes that he is ready for the world cup ahead of the black stars so let's move on to our final story and that will do with abdo fatal isahaku he is now a player for sporting cp he also played in ghana premier league that is for Dreams FC. Before that, he moved on from Steadfast in a Division 1 league, joined um, their Ghana Premier League side Dreams before he moved on to Sporting CP um, in an undisclosed fee, but having about 60 million release clause in his deal. Now, he had his first game for Sporting CP senior side last two days, as of the time this video is being recorded, and after the, afterwards, he has posted this on his official Twitter handle. He said, This night was amazing for me. 
happy to play my first official game for the Lions. Lovely support from the lovely fans and great teamwork. And we came out with the three plus points. Okay, so he means that he came out with plus three points in this particular game that they won by three goals. And I've already told you, you came to play about, you know, um, 10 minutes for the club where he was rated around 6.5. In that particular game and i think he has a lot of way to go and he needs to do well so that he can join the black stars of ghana ahead of the qatar world cup so these are the updates one of atarisha aku two on jordan are you and three on the new sensation matthew enim kujo let me know what you think about it in the comment section smash on the subscribe button join the channel if you haven't and we shall meet in the next one bye bye for now subscribe to the channel Hit on the notification bell for more.